what's up y'all it's your girl t and i'm back with a brand new video if you're new to my channel my name is t and nicole but everyone calls me t welcome to the sweet life if you're not already part of the family what do you know what you like i gotta do is press subscribe to join the family and become a loyal sweet t today if you like videos like this make sure you give this video a big thumbs up if you love me subscribe to my channel and if you really love me make sure you turn the notification bell on so you'll never miss a post for me as always, thanks so much for watching my life is Now let's get into this video. So I don't really know what this video is gonna be about, but you will see. <laughs> I really just picked up the camera to start recording because my hair cute or whatever. It shrunk up a little bit, but this is kind of like a braid out. I have my hair in like two braids for like a week. Took it down, let the edges a little bit, put it in some like I guess you would call these face buns and left a little curly curly you can't see it but a little curly curly right there and a little curly curly right there and just let it be messy 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 and um it's cute but right now i am so excited because it's sunday um i worked overtime today and i worked overtime all last week but i ain't gonna be complaining when i get that money but um girl <laughs> it's been a very very busy week I was going to take care of me to get a fill up and to get my oil changed, but girl, I was so tired. I was seeing the blue. I'm just playing. But for real, I was real tired. So I was just trying to get that done. So I did that Friday, Saturday, which was yesterday. I came home, took a shower. No, I took a bath. I soaked in the tub, baby girl. And then I watched Harriet, which is a movie about Harriet Tubman. Which was really good, and I'm so glad that I watched it because I feel like I can relate to her with the visions and stuff like that. So that was really good, and I'm really glad that like people are like openly talking more about like how God works through them and the gifts that He has given them specifically. Because I read about that in Miss Tabitha Brown's book, also, God gives her visions, also. And if y'all watch my previous videos, y'all know that like I be talking about like my relationship with God for the past. I've had this channel probably like seven years, and I've mentioned it several times. But like now, I'm becoming stronger in the, the in the spirit. So like my man, I guess the flesh I always weak because it's just this is what we born into or whatever. But you can't let it control you. You have to be stronger and just abstain from things that you know are not good for you. And just try your best to be in your word because we need that in us to fight the enemy. And we need to be filled with the Holy Spirit so that we can know how to hear God's voice and discern between his voice and the devil. And even visions and dreams and when you hear you know, him talking, you got to be able to understand who is it, you know, and discern what God, you know, tell me that or whatever. But anyways, you got to pray this way. You got to have a, you know, close relationship. God is my best friend. It's my daddy, period. But, um, yeah, this video is just going to be like, not even a like little day, y'all. I'm just let y'all know what is going on with my business. Well, I didn't show y'all last week because your girl was tired and I'm tired now. But I'm going to go to my mom's house. My sister want me to do her. <laughs> Don't feel like it, baby. I've been looking forward to this Sunday since last Sunday. That's how deep it is. And I got two days off. But Tuesday, I got to take my mama to the hospital <sighs> or whatever. So, yeah, I'm going to do that. Hopefully we can be done with it like as soon as possible so that I can get myself wind down because the next day I gotta work both jobs or whatever. So yeah, and we work for 12 hours now. Baby. Ugh. But it's cool, it's just a season. I ain't tripping. I've been telling God I'm only wanna speak of good things. I don't wanna complain because I don't have a reason to. But anyways, um yeah. My hair cute, y'all like it. It's messy. I mean, that was the point. I wanted it to be messy. I mean, y'all seen my hair like this before, but your girl getting a little bit of length. Let me let me see. Getting a little bit of length. Goodness, look, I almost. Ah, ah. I know this name. I'm sorry, y'all, but ah, 
girl, not too good to her in your mouth again. Don't judge me. I know I can unprecedented with these dicks up. But anyways, yeah. Um, love y'all. Thank you for watching my videos. I appreciate it so much because this is another stream of income. And your girl been in a bag. And hopefully one day this will be my like main source of income as far as like full time, whatever, you know what I mean? But thank y'all because um <laughs> I'm grateful, I'm so grateful. Ever since I was a little girl, before I even knew what a stay at home mom was, I didn't even know there was a thing, y'all. But it's just like I always used to just think of it. Like I wanna be at home with my children. I wanna raise my children. I wanna homeschool my children. It just seemed like this really, really fun, chill thing, which is fun. And it had chill moments, but it gets very busy. <laughs> But, as y'all know, if y'all watch my videos, I am an aspiring stay-at-home mom. Aspiring means I am not that yet, but I have been before and I would like to be continuously. But, the bills gotta get paid, baby. I gotta have money in my pocket. It's kids to be taken care of. So, yeah. And I just, like, girl, money. Everything costs money. Like, so, yeah, I'm trying to stack this bread until they stack me, if that makes sense. But anyways, you can't tell, baby, I look a little, little sleepy. I'm Thanksgiving, I was looking high than a mother freaker. I had to work on Thanksgiving, y'all, but I ain't tripping. Um, but yeah, I was looking high, and like I'm kind of looking a little like that now. <laughs> Which I am ready to wind down, but I gotta go run the errands. Yeah, I've been wearing this freaking hat <laughs> for like a week. So last night I was like, girl, take them braids down and wear your hair free. So I did. And this is what I got. But anyway, y'all, I don't know. I'm just talking, updating y'all on what's going on with me currently. I did, but well, I ain't go to Sam's. I asked my mama if she would go to Sam's for me because. I just didn't have the mental capacity to go in the grocery store. I really need to go to the grocery store because we need groceries. So, I don't know. If, I mean, I've got to do it, but I just, mm. but my mama did go and say for me to get the household stuff that I need. I'm so grateful for that. And um, I did get the girls a few, like, uh, clothes. I told y'all they needed clothes and stuff. And then, like, undergarments and socks and stuff like that um i didn't like do a haul but y'all i've been busy 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 but i ain't tripping um i don't know like i feel like it's sleep in my eye but i don't know whenever i go to the grocery store i might do a grocery haul and i might let y'all see what it like after sam's possibly um and I didn't really get the girls that much stuff. I just got them like, I ain't gonna say knickknacks, but I got them like leggings and like t-shirts and stuff like that to wear around the house. But I think I wanna, I might wanna go like to Gap, H&M, I wanna maybe Target, Walmart, um, and maybe like Marshalls, TJ Maxx to see, you know what I'm saying, what I can find. And probably Ross too. Uh, just get them some cute little clothes or whatever. They got some cute little coats and winter hats and stuff like that. I probably get them some more jackets and maybe a little, little hat fit. Let them peek it. And another coat. Let them probably peek it. Um, and I, uh, I want to get them some more boots. They got some boots, but I want to get them some more. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I'm going to try to vlog, y'all. I still need to get these other videos out, which... Y'all might not even see this for a minute. I don't even know if I'm going to post this. I always say that. But because I want to post these other videos that I haven't posted yet. But I just wanted to record because the girl you need to get back in the room, honey. <sighs> mm-hmm. But, yeah, I've been reading my Tyler Perry book, y'all. I'm almost done with it, and I can't wait to get done with it because I'm going to watch the documentary. Uh, it's on Prime Video. But I want to finish the book first, so when I finish the book, I'm going to 
watched a documentary. I've been trying to watch movies. I had watched this movie called The Best Christmas Ever on Netflix with Brandy in it. It's really, really good. Um, I've been watching like, you know, little Christmas movies and just been trying to like watch stuff because like I've been trying to like, I mean, I don't, I don't, what I do on my phone is like watch videos or also listen to videos, play games. I be playing like Monopoly Go, Toy Blast, like a little scavenger hunt game. I'm probably gonna start playing chess because one of my coworkers told me about that. But yeah, and like I've been trying to like learn Spanish, learn sign language like fluently. Um, like refresh with like math and stuff like that on like a higher level, of course, because I am an adult. <laughs> I know the basics. But uh, just refresh my brain. Uh, yeah, and it's been very, very fun. Very enjoyable, y'all. Especially since I started reading, like, uh, it's like my mind just craves learning. And that's what I wanted. But anyways, I'm about to go. Yeah, it's on my freaking eye. And I had, took my glasses off and I've been wearing my contacts probably for, like, the past few days. Because I wanted to see was my glasses breaking my face out. And I think it was because my jaw would be real dusty. And I think my glasses are carry dirt. So, I mean, my face is broken out. You can see it. But it is, like, clearing up from what it was looking like when I was wearing my glasses. So, I don't know. But anyways, let's see. I'm going to try to keep my routine up. Well, I do keep my routine up. But I'm going to make sure I wash my face twice a day. Anyway, I'm doing a lot of talking. Uh, I will see y'all later. I don't know what this video is going to be about. But I added to something. Uh, hope y'all enjoy. I love you guys. Thanks for the support. I really appreciate it a lot. Like, for real, everybody that watch my videos, like my videos, share my video, whatever. I appreciate it. Even if I get one view, like, it's really great because I'm not trying to be an influencer. I'm trying to be impactful, which to me, that is just being a living example of God's love and. If you really know my story, watch my videos, you will see that he works through and through my life. And I'm so grateful for it. And everything that I am is because of him. And I would never take that away from him. Um, yes. But anyways, I'll see y'all later. Peace. Because I'm going to talk about God. Period. <laughs> because I'm going to talk about us. Period, 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 period. Peace. Recording. Yeah. Yeah. It's going by yourself now. Mm -hmm. Well, I am washing the dishes from last night. Pretty out here made some chicken. Look out, eat some chicken and fries.
If you're new to my channel, my name is Tierney Nicole, but everyone calls me T, and welcome to the street. Like, if you're not already a part of the family, what do you know? Which life? All you gotta do is press subscribe to join the family and become a lady sweet to today. If you like videos like this, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. If you love me, subscribe to my channel. And if you really love me, make sure you turn on the notification bell on so you'll never miss a post from me. As always, thanks so much for watching. My life is T. Now let's get into this video. So, I... I'm happy to see my baby. So guys, Anna is sitting here eating the orange that she peeled. Pretty much a mandarin orange. I'm so proud of her for feeling that. This is the stuff that I got from Sam's. Not those plates, I got those from Walmart. I need to take them back, but I'm not. I'm just gonna keep them <laughs> and that way we'll never run out of plates. I got the paper towels, tissue, and the garbage bags are in there. Like corn chips. Those are corn chips. That is the dishwasher going because I told y'all I wanted to clean it. You can see the dishes. I just laid them over there to dry while that is cleaning itself out. I was reading to Anna these books that we got from Walmart. Where there are so many of them. Blue and Bingo. But yes, um, and then we're going to do. Anna's been practicing writing her letters and stuff like that. And um, so we can finish this book. Uh, so yeah, um, we're gonna do that. I'm gonna go ahead and make the breakfast um, because I got the stuff out. I did get Anna to record me, but she just recorded my butt. <laughs> but I might still post it so y'all can hear me talking. But now I'm going to go ahead and um, I was listening to a sermon uh, from, I think his name is Keon Henderson. I really, really like him. I really like him a lot. He got it for real. And I thank God for introducing me to new people in ministry because everyone teaches in a different way. Hopefully y'all can hear me because of this. But I put the dishes right here until they're dry while this dishwasher is cleaning itself because that was much needed. So this is what I'm gonna make them. Eggs, pancakes. I'm gonna cut me up one of these and saute it, and then I'm gonna make the girls these. Uh, I'm probably gonna finish this mess of the sermon and I'm gonna let y'all see it when it's done. Uh, y'all heard on a coffee mix there. I just gave her some allergen medicine and I gave them some rubber sets and last night with an allergy pill and I just got her some vitamins so in a few hours I'm gonna give her some more rubber testing because she literally just got over a cold but weather comes to changing so it's to be expected oh well, here are the garbage bags I told y'all we was taking it down but I haven't taken it down yet the girls do not want to get rid of these balloons y'all this bag is full of like Tupperware that I need to send back to his mom. I had cleaned these pages. Korea, GG. Uh, I caught myself trying to put some of the things that my mom has given us on the table. This says magic is in you. They you know that. For Mario and then Mariana, mom, or whatever. This they were hats <laughs> that for some reason they just. <laughs> Didn't put the oopsie. I was shaking the table. <laughs> yeah, you shook it. Shook it. Okay, but anyways, I'm about to make their breakfast real quick. Listen to my sermon, and Amaria is still asleep. But when I finish cooking, I'm gonna wake up. And also, I have not read my devotionals yet today, but I got them right here. So when I finish making breakfast, I'm gonna read those. Well, Looking forward to it because I also want to journal. I just finished reading on one book, but when I get done cooking, we'll get to that schoolwork. Also, I want to go, today my grandma's birthday, so I really wanna take them to go get her a present and take it to her so we can tell her happy birthday. 
today i colored this y'all i've been coloring a lot lately which has been really really you see his gold tooth Ooh. yeah don't play with it but it has been just something that has been helping me to keep my mind clear and i've been enjoying it but i know about ready to so i'm about to get some breakfast i will show y'all but i'm gonna use my phone to finish listening to this sermon and i will see y'all when it's done hope you enjoy this video just a random vlog just like all my vlogs are but and thanks for supporting me in my channel and journey thank you for the positive words and words of wisdom i appreciate it y'all very very much um, yeah but i love you guys and i know my face is looking how it's looking but i see progress because it was a lot of stuff going on up in here but since i haven't been wearing my glasses I can feel a difference, uh, whatever. But like these two don't just kind of look pretty fine because I know it's gonna go away. But anyways, peace. See you later. Okay, so their sausage is done. My sausage is still cooking. We're trying to. I don't want to pack the eggs with her little friend. <laughs> I don't know. Are you gonna craft one egg? Yeah. I mean, I'm gonna. Okay, hold right. the camera. Let me crack one and then okay. you cut those. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Hold it. You gotta. You holding the camera on what you're looking at. What do you see? So that means that you need to hold it down okay. so you can see that, okay? Yeah. So, can y'all hear me talking and my mama? So, I'm, I'm doing this for my second time. I made some brownies with my cousin and my sister and my titi. Last time when we was over at okay, my granny's house. You said you're, you're doing one. Good job, good job. No, I'm going to crack a few and then I'm going to let you crack two of them. Can you okay? crack? No, I, I want you to crack two and I can crack one, two, three, four, five. Okay. No, hold on. Hold on. Let me see. Let me see. Okay. Let me see. Okay. Show them the four eggs. So this is one, two, three, and four. Okay, good. Show them my sausage. And that's sausage. that's my and mama that's big that's sausage. That. <laughs> okay. That's a sausage, and that's Ow. my sausage. With the oh, two ones. Okay, I'm just gonna put my sausage on this plate for a second. Mine. Yeah, it's fine. It look like this. That's my okay, mama. So she the eggs. You gonna crack the egg? Yes. Okay. And then here's the trash can. Here I took the top off so you can just throw it in there. Okay. Let's do like a little bit. Mm -hmm. Good job. Oops. It's okay. Keep pregnant. You're doing good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's okay. Keep going. No Try to pull it apart. No eggs. Good job. Good job. Good job. No eggshells? Yeah. Good job. So that's the yucky part. Yay, I only got the egg. Yeah. Good job. Okay, yeah. good job. No. Oops, sorry. Give me that, please. <laughs> good job. Okay, I'll hold it. Okay, crack mm -hmm. another one. Good job. One egg down, three more to go. Yeah, it's only two more to go. Yes, two more. Good job, girl. I'm so proud of you. Yay, yes. girl, you cracked the eggs better than me. It's fine. <laughs> oh, wow. Miss Confident. Okay. <laughs> it's okay. Just let your sister slip in peace. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's fine. Put it over the bowl. Put it in the bowl. Good job. Yep. Good I cut this better than my sister. Yes. Good job. Okay. Go. One more. I can do it. 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 Okay. 
Oh, Who taught that? you how to do that? Nobody. I just didn't. Wow. Kitty told me to cry. Wow. I need to use your technique. It's fine. No shells. No shell. Zoom. No shell. Zoom. Good job. Just throw it away. It's fine, it's fine. Okay, good job, girl. Let me get you a pepper. Oh, my hands are cold. Mm -hmm. My hands cold. Okay, so now I'm going to mix it up and put it in there. I want to mix it. Okay. Peace, y'all. We'll see y'all in a minute when everything is done. Okay, so we are in Walmart and we're trying to pick out a basket for my grandma. So we picked up this candy that she liked chocolate she used to actually make these homemade so we're going to get these for her then we're about to go find a card and some cupcakes and a bag okay so anna what did you pick this happy birthday bear with the we got this card right here Okay. And then this card is super sweet. Okay. It's like a little house. Oh, it's like a little mail thing. All the way up like this. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. And we got this little mail thing. Mm -hmm. It's envelope. And then this card. We don't see it. Okay, Anna, just leave it alone before you carry it. And then this, well, um, they got some candy that they don't want, apparently. Got her some little cupcakes, she got these chips, and this all the candy she likes. And I got this going for it, but yeah. And Mari said she wanted to pick up something else, so I don't know what that'll be. Okay, so we gonna get this bag. Oh snap, this is hard. And this tissue paper. And we're done. I'm gonna put it together and you'll see the end results. Okay, y'all, so we just, we just left from inside of Walmart. As you can see, I just finished packing up my grandma's stuff. And it's already in the bag. We put everything in there. The girls got some candy or whatever. <laughs> now I'm already happy. We're about to get ready to go drop this off. It's almost five o'clock and the sun is starting to go down. So we're trying to get to the other side of town before the sun go down so we can get back home or whatever. But today is my grandma's actual birthday. So I wanted to take this, even though she's probably not gonna let us stay there long because it's about to get dark. But I'm about to hurry up and go. Love you guys. See y'all later. Sorry I couldn't really vlog in Walmart. We was trying to hurry up, but yeah. <laughs> What's up, y'all? Okay, so today took a turn. Basically, I did. I'm in my mama's house. So basically, I did get to go to my grandma's house and drop her stuff off or whatever. But when I got there, my car was acting like it didn't want to like turn or go. So, uh that was strange but i just kind of ignored it which i shouldn't have but when it was time to leave i tried to crank my car up and it didn't want to crank up and like y'all i haven't had my truck almost three years in march and it hasn't given me any trouble besides like tires and battery oh like when i first got it but anyways so my car was dead i had to get a boost off but the still like the alternator was pulling so much power from it so i had went to o'reilly and had to get a new battery and a new alternator thankfully my boyfriend's dad knows how to do things like that so he pulled up like i was vip and i feel like a little princess or whatever and he basically installed the stuff in my car in less than two hours and now i'm back up and running but i'm so grateful because i was sad and y'all my this is my day off and like i literally have not gotten to even chill 
so that's my day <laughs> i'm at my mama's house waiting on my sister to take me back because i'm trying to see if the girls can stay here because i gotta take my mama somewhere in the morning because if they don't then then they're gonna have to be me while i'm waiting on my mama or whatever but yeah anyways i'm about to I don't want to wake Anna up. She's asleep. And I don't want to wake her up and take her out the house and stuff. So I'm just trying to see if, yeah, she can um, keep going until we get done or whatever. But anyways, um, I ain't gonna lie, I'm lucky sleepy. <laughs> but, yeah. I'm about to see if I can and call my sister and yeah this is how my day been going and the girls are over here on the couch see on the sleep Omar is uh, playing a game or something but anyways yeah <sighs> they had some chicken y'all I'm about to clean up they mess <laughs> but I had got them some chicken or whatever, so they're gonna be hungry. I'm gonna put this in the trash or whatever. A little bit. Yeah. Well, like, my kids know how to throw their own trash away, but I be putting them leave it. And I clean it up because sometimes when it be stuffed with like sauce, they be getting it all over the garbage can and it just more of a mess for me to clean up. So I'd rather just clean throw it away myself if that makes sense but anyways i will see y'all later 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 i don't know when later will be but i'm gonna add this to the vlog i love you guys appreciate the people that you have in your life appreciate the good people be a good person love yourself love others don't be mean be nice anyways i'll see y'all later peace y'all see my face clearing up it's taking a little a little time but have a little faith Nothing but good vibes and a little bit of faith. I'm gonna put that on a shirt one day. But yeah, my little, my little face is doing what she's supposed to do. <sighs> I'm about to drink this. I don't know, I like these, y'all. They're so good. I'm about to drink this and call my sister and I'm gonna see y'all later. I'm gonna call y'all back. what's up y'all it's your girl t and i'm back with a brand new video so i'm adding this into the vlog that i started for the past few days i'm just i just want to give y'all like an update of what's really going on so i'm in the dining room right now i just finished washing my face and getting my hair together and getting dressed or whatever because I'm actually ready to go meet my mom in my sister's house so I can see my nephew. So my mom can see my nephew before she have her surgery or whatever. Um uh yeah. So it's like outpatient surgery, so when she's done, we'll be able to leave. She's saying she wanna drive. I'm not sure if that's possible or that's gonna happen or whatever but we'll see but hopefully i can get back home at a decent time so i can get myself together do my nighttime routine and wind down because i gotta go to work tomorrow but crazy thing is yesterday me and the girls went to walmart to gather some things for my grandma's birthday which was yesterday uh and yeah my car my precious little baby, my victory, my sweet, sweet victory, uh, didn't want to start when I got in my grandma's driveway. Well, actually, when I was pulling in the driveway, like, I guess the battery light came on, and then I guess, like, a traction light came on or something like that, and it's like the car jerked, and it was, like, hard for me to turn the car like you needed some power steering fluid or something like that and i was like what the heck but i thought that i just turned too hard so we went in there or whatever we came out and then 
my car wouldn't start. It wouldn't turn over. And I'm like, oh God, I got the kids. It's dark. What the heck? So I tried it a few times and it didn't work. I'm like, dang, what could it be? Is it my starter? Is it my alternator? Is it my battery? Because like the battery that I had, I had it for like almost two years or whatever. In my car, I've had it coming up next year. It'll be three years or whatever. Haven't given me any trouble being a sweet beauty. Uh, I had to buy a new battery. That was one thing. I keep my oil changed regularly. And I haven't had to get new tires, but next year I'm going to get some new tires. Um, but I was told that my tires are still good. Practically still look new. Um, but I just had like an issue with like the sensor or whatever. But my car is old. It's like a 2012. So, yeah. But anyways, that's my baby, and she been doing me real good. But so basically, I had to get I had to get my car boosted off. But even with that, the alternator was pulling so much power that it was draining my battery. So I got a new battery, new alternator. Thank the Lord that my boyfriend's dad knows how to work on cars. So he pulled the joker out right in front of the um store and put it in for me and uh yeah it took less than two hours and my baby is back up and running oh uh, it's a few things on my list that i want to get as far as maintenance on my truck just to keep my baby up and running you know what i'm saying i have been saying it to my boyfriend for the past few weeks and then voila but it's cool god worked it out basically i'm adding this part to the video because I just want to say, like, <sighs> but basically, I just want to say, like, God is so good. Like, even when things, good things don't happen, God's still good. And, like, I can't really remember the scripture, but it's basically a scripture saying that we are prone to trouble. <laughs> trouble is going to come. It's inevitable for us to not have trouble because we are God's people. The people who choose to live their life according to God's, like, um, according to God's will, basically. So, the people who want to dwell in his presence and the people that want to be filled with the Holy Spirit and the people who are called to do ministry and just be a living example of who God is and his love and sharing the word of God with the world, you will face trouble because basically God uses us to testify to people who don't believe that he is real because the people who caused the trouble was there during the trouble they heard about the trouble saw the trouble um and i see you come out of it like walking through the fire and you come out untouched or looking untouched that's amazing like it's like i can't believe my eyes because i said in a previous video that i see people from over the years and they see me and they be looking at me like they be shocked that i'm like still alive and i said this to my boyfriend before he was like you're right people probably do think that or they probably think how does she look better or how does she look the same or how does she still look so youthful or how does she still look good with everything that she's been through? Or if it's the person that put you through things, how do they still look like they haven't been touched? It's God's grace, his goodness, and the things that you put into your body is what you get out. How you treat people is what you receive back. And just being a good person is not going to get you to heaven. Because the same way that your heart can tell you to do good, your heart can also tell you to do evil. So, that's not enough. <laughs> it's not enough just being good. It's not enough. 
because we choose to be good the same way we could choose to be bad. So basically, all I'm saying is just live in your truth, be who you are, appreciate the good, the bad, the ugly, because it all has a purpose. I never knew in a million years that God telling me to make a YouTube channel would make me more confident, make me be able to just be more of myself, learn myself, who am I? And he always told me that I would be in ministry, I would be a public speaker, that I would be a motivational speaker, that, you know, I would help to save souls, basically. Ever since I was a teenager, that's when I started to understand it. And I was so scared. I'm like, nah, not me, God. I don't see me doing that. That's a bit much. I would love to do it. But I don't see how I would do it. I'm scared. I'm scared to do that. <laughs> like, I don't know enough about preaching and teaching. But I still don't even know much of God's word. But I know who he is. Like, I ain't have to read his word to know his heart because he live inside of me. I talk to him every single day. He's my best friend. And ever since I was a little girl, probably like kindergarten, maybe even preschool, I always just had a heart to know who is God. Who is he? Why is he so good? Like, every time trouble come, he saved me. He spared me. He showed me how to get out of it. He even tell me ways to resist it before it even happened but i didn't understand his voice i didn't understand that was him telling me even now today when i keep going through situations he telling me don't do this or don't or do that or whatever and i do it or i don't do it and then i suffer the consequences and i'm like oh he told me what to do but i'm learning to hear his voice it's a, it's amazing. It's awesome. It's beautiful. And I'm just really learning to be more gentle and patient and kind. And that love is enough. Someone once told me that love was not enough. And I've even said it myself. But it makes me cry to think that love is not enough. Because love makes the world go around. Love conquers all. Love will make you do wrong. Love will make you do right. Love. I can't really think of that part of the scripture. But love is enough. Because if you love a person, you want to trust them. If you love a person, you want to respect them. If you love a person, you want to communicate with them. If you love somebody... You want to, you want them in your life. And I could love anybody. I really can. But it's different levels of love. It's different types of love. Stuff like that. But anyway, I'm just recording this because I want to add it to my video. Because maybe somebody needs to hear it. But God is good. Even if you're in a sticky situation, he's still good. Don't ever lose faith. Don't ever not believe that he won't deliver his promises because... This temple, like he just using you to for his promise to come to pass for you, for other people. Like you living in an answer prayer. We all are in some way. And you might not be you might not feel like you are today, but then maybe tomorrow you will feel like it. Because when the thing went on with my car, I wasn't even upset. I wasn't hurt. I wasn't worried. I knew it was going to be okay, and I knew I was going to figure it out. <laughs> That's the first time that I've ever had car trouble, and I wasn't even scared. I wasn't even worried, and I felt safe. Like, it happened in my grandma's house. It could have happened anywhere. It could have happened at Walmart. It could have happened at a red light. It could have happened anywhere, but it happened in a safe space. And so many people came to my rescue. I told my uh, boyfriend's mom that I felt like a princess because... I felt like, you know, 
I was taken care of. I was surrounded by love and protected and I didn't have to worry. And that's a feeling that I've always wanted ever since I was a little girl. God has always given me that feeling, but I've never been surrounded by a village of people that made me feel like we got you for real. For real. You know what I'm saying? And that's a blessing. But anyways, uh, <sighs> nurture your village. Like, little things can go a long way. And, like, don't overlook somebody's struggle. If you know that somebody is hungry, feed them. If you know somebody need a ride, ask them to take them somewhere. If you know that somebody needs somewhere to stay, offer your couch for a night or offer to pay for a hotel or offer some way to help them. Don't just leave a person out there that you care about or that you say you care about and not do anything because you will regret it. Like I have so much peace because I know that everybody that I've encountered that had an issue, I tried to figure it out with them or for them if I could. And if I couldn't, I was able to point them in the direction of somebody that could. And I had peace because of it. Like, I'm not saying that other people's burdens have to be your responsibility, but love your neighbor as you love yourself. Like, that's big. Like, that's big. Treat people the way you want to be treated. Because if you was down on your look and you didn't have it, you will want somebody to be there for you. You will want somebody to lend out their hand, their shoulder to cry on, to help you. So try to do it for somebody else. Because everything is full circle. And what you put out is what you get. You read what you sow. And I've been listening to this song lately. This is my season for grace, for favor. This is my season to reap what I have sown. Yes. Haven't been perfect. But I know. Hold on, wait. Let me see. What's the what? I've been listening to this song every single day and I can't remember the words. Hold on, let me see. Let me see. Uh I think it is. Haven't been perfect, but I sure been faithful. See, God's got a purpose, and I know he's able, yeah. I gotta see in the ground that he's blessing, no more stressing. I gotta see in the ground, and I'm knowing that he's showing this is my season for grace. For favor, this is my season to reap what I have sown. Yes, this is my season for grace and favor. Yes, because I just know that I literally have a seed in the ground. Like, you have ancestors that have passed on. You are living in their answered prayers. Like, it is always just a dream for a person to want their future generations to do better, to be better, to have more than them. Like, the, in, the vision that I have for my children, the things that God has shown me, like, I can't even fathom <laughs> That is real, but I know it because God has already told me. And even where I'm at now, like, a lot of it does not make sense. But it makes sense because it is the path that he chose for me. Because somebody had to show that even though, what is it? Even though he slayed me, like, I, God... It's like he waiting for you in the valley. <laughs> like, you walk through the valley of the shadow of death and you fear no evil. He is waiting for you. Like, but you scared to go in the valley. But he waiting in the valley so he can walk with you. Like, don't be afraid to step out on faith. And I might be saying a lot of things 
that just don't make sense. But God is good. He's for real. He good for real. And like, even, man, I got to finish reading the book of Job. But sometimes, y'all, I be, the power of the Holy Spirit is so strong that like, and I'm so sensitive. So like when I get to reading and feeling and I'm just like crying and I'm just like, wow. If he can do it for them, I know he can do it for me. Cause he didn't stop blessing. He ain't stopped blessing just because times have changed. So anyways, I love y'all. I will see y'all later. Um, hope everything goes well with my mom. I want to do my hair in some mini tweets, but honestly, this style is looking pretty cute. But I know by Sunday, I'm going to be over it. So maybe today I could try to do my hair in the mini tweets hairstyle and still put it like this. But it's, it'll just be in the mini tweets so I can have me some hang time. But yeah. Uh, I don't even know if I'm posting these y'all because I don't even know if anything I see makes sense. But anyways, I love y'all and I'll see y'all later. Peace. Keep your faith. Don't give up. Keep going. God is good. God is real. I ain't trying to convince you. I'm just letting you know my point of view. But I right. Peace.
Ew. <laughs> what you doing, Tata? Tata. 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 What did this say, Mama? Dear Santa, please stop here. Shut down. Dear Santa, please stop here. Ah, Anna. I mean, Tyler, out. Anna, you hurt my chest. I got him. I got him. You got him? Yeah, let's just let him go in the drawer. So, I said once. Oh. Yeah, I got to go home. Do some to my hair. Peace. Okay. Well, soon as I thought everything was good, my mama decided she wants to walk in the kitchen and ask Samaria to assist her. We hear a boom. And I'm thinking there's something fail. Amaria knocks him down trying to get a snack. But no, my mom fell in the kitchen because she want to go and get a snack. And she, they told her it's going to take like hours for her legs to get the feeling back. But she's still trying to walk. <sighs> I was just about to go home. But yeah, update. Update. She scared you, Amaria. Yeah, she scared me too. She wants some more. Okay, y'all. So I am at home and I'm about to pick my lunch. My boyfriend just went to give me some Taco Bell so I can take some burritos to get my lunch. And I'm actually going to eat one burrito and some nacho fries tonight. He remembered to get the cheese. Um, but my mom is home safe and sound and I got like a beefy milk something with some chips some nacho cheese regular cheese ground beef and rice I wanted it because it got rice in it so this should be good feeling like I made some oatmeal in the morning whatever I got some water in there and this is why I'm pushed I still have a drunk but it's fine and I'm probably gonna put some applesauce in here Hello. And I guess I could put this y'all on to see if it's old. Actually, it is old. <laughs> but I got some more right here. This is kids. I need to get some more. I actually need to go grocery shopping. Let me see. They got strawberry. I'm going to try to get strawberry. Hold on. Right here. I think it's strawberry. Yeah, I'm going to get this. Let's see if this. Okay, this don't expire to December. Oh, let me see. I'm gonna give me a little snack and snack. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna bring me some hot chocolate. My boyfriend done demolished this. He love hot chocolate. And I actually might bring me some pudding. For some reason, I'm having like a little chocolate uh, craving or whatever. I really am not a big chocolate fan. But I think I want that. And I guess, I don't know. I guess I'll say the last two applesauces for the girls. But yeah, this is what I'm putting my thing. I actually got these. The girls haven't even got these yet. I'm gonna try to open them the other day. Actually, I'm gonna open them. So I'm gonna take this. I'm gonna take one. I never tried these, but hopefully they do it. Usually, great value because these too good. So, yeah. So, I got some snacks. Whatever, I'm gonna throw this in that trash because it's old. But yeah. Actually, I ate one the other day and I didn't even look at the date. So, actually, I probably could eat it. But it's. It's say October 29th. But yeah, I don't know. Anyways, all right, y'all. I'll see y'all later. I don't know how I'm in this vlog. Maybe I'll let y'all see you later. I'm about to smash these. I haven't had these in so long. They put so much seasoning on them. I just know they fine. And it's like 8 o'clock. It just turned 8 o'clock. So I'm about to watch the Good Burger movie again. Hopefully I don't fall asleep on it this time. But I got my bunny on. This one I'm not showing my face. I just got out the shower. I look, you know, look good. You know what I'm saying? I look clean. Or I got lint on my clothes or whatever. But yeah. Um, yeah, I look, I look clean. But y'all yeah, see me. I done oiled all up and everything. Need to clean the fridge right now. But. Maybe I'll find time to do that. Anyways, I'm going to see y'all later. Peace. I'm going to leave y'all this. Don't let... Okay, what did it say? Wait. Don't let others 
affect i'm recording like under now don't let others affect your day make the most of it and be truly happy i don't know who needs that but if you need it let it do what he's supposed to do because he be helping me so that's why i put it up there chick-fil-a be writing these little things i don't know if they still do it because i ain't i mean i haven't been there in a minute because my boyfriend be going to go get my food i don't be going nowhere unless i got food so yeah if you need that yeah so peace see y'all later finally Finally finished watching Good Burger, guys. And I got one right there. It's so, one, two, three, four. Hold on. You have to find five. So did you find all five? Or did you circle all five of the bees? Yes, I got one, two, three, four, five. Good job, <laughs> big girl. Okay, now let's move to the next thing. Hold on. It says help the dog get to the ball trace the path so you have to trace the path first before you mark it no no good job that was very smart so, whoa, whoa. Oops. go here go here go here go here Good job, Anna. Great job. I know it because the ball is right here. Why would you put the ball right there? Okay. So what we did before that was we had to circle all of the pictures that start. Hold on. Let me show them. They start with the bee. And then I call it the butterfly. And then she had to trace the path for the worm to get to the apple and then she had to circle all the A's and then right here she had to color all the A's and then color the alligator green. So and now let's see what we have to do next. Hold on, do we already do this one? Mm -hmm. Okay, so we did the B. So it's next. Now it's C. So it wants us to color the cat blue. And then right here it says, draw lines from the pictures that begin with the letter C to the basket. C. Did you start with it? Oh, no. Good job. Banana. Okay, so See? that's a banana. This is corn. This is a cake. This is a carrot. And this is an apple, but you got it right. Carrot starts with a C. Cake starts with a C. And corn starts, starts with, with a C. C. Good job following directions. Oh, Yay! Where the, the eraser flew yes. somewhere. Yes. Okay, and then we're gonna color this blue. But she's like over the coloring. <laughs> so we probably just gonna skip that. Do you want to color this blue? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So next, you have to do like the other pictures and find and circle the five hidden C's in the picture. One, two, three, four. Hmm, wonder where the fifth one is at. Whoops, be careful before you fall. Two, three. Four. And there's one more somewhere. Look all over the page. Everywhere. It's hiding in plain sight. Oh, I think it's right here. No, that's not it, but I thought that too. Keep looking. Look all by the cow and everything. Mm -hmm. Not on the cow, too. It's right here. <laughs> good job. In the dark. That was so good. Now I got one, two, three. Four, five. Good job, big can girl. We're gonna do a pat. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. Peace. And go. Good job. Okay, so you read. Okay, good job. So, what are those words again? These up here? No. Well, you could. Can you reread the whole thing again? Uh, sure. 
The big boy said, stop. The big boy said, go. Go said the big, I mean, not big, I mean, the boy. <laughs> Good job. Stop said the boy. I can stop and go. Okay, good job. Now Anna's practicing her shapes. Thank you, Cordelia, giving us our daily forehead kisses. Cordelia. <laughs> Smiley face, Anna. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Good job. You can barely see that. <laughs> it's fine. I'm about to do it better. It's okay. You're doing great. Y'all ready to watch it? Mm -hmm. Does it look like it'll be good? Mm -hmm. Let's see if it's Can a chance. You, mm -hmm. you said hands up, but leave it at the door. Yeah, right here, too. I'll leave it at the door. Why is he called Candy Cane? I don't know. This is important. So I'm going to show you guys something. When I show you what I'm going to show you, you don't freak out. My teeth. No, you should. I just got my teeth cleaned. My teeth up there. But, mm hmm Yeah, this too. Them tools. Does it feel great? <laughs> but. Okay, it took a few verses. This is my hair, but I don't like it. Your Honor, I, I just can't say uh, <laughs> about the whole key situation. I gave some of my keys. Yeah. Oh, don't you ever know? just gave Anna a compliment and told Anna that she wrote her lowercase letter A better than her. <laughs> and now that I'm having Anna do her lowercase letters, she's like, it's hard. But when it's no pressure, it's easy. Can you bring me something so I can get your snot, get your DNA off me, please? But anyways, real life mom things. Amari is doing amazing. She is writing her numbers all the way to 100. All by herself. This is gross. <laughs> and Anna is practicing writing her letters A through J and recognizing them. Uppercase and lowercase. And practicing writing her numbers 0 through 5. <laughs> And uh, Amaria has mastered counting by fives, but now we're gonna work on counting by twos. And I'm pretty sure counting by tens will be easy also. 
but Canva 2s might not be as easy, but we're going to practice on it. And they are both doing great right now. Anna is doing uh, letters and Amari is doing math. But when Amari finishes this math, next we're going to do language arts. So let me show y'all a little bit of Amari's handwriting. She's doing great. So this is Amari's this is a little calendar i mean not a calendar but a number grid and she's made it to 67 is the next number and then as you can see right here we're gonna count by twos so yeah but she's done good and actually she skipped over something so we're gonna have to go back and do this right here which is one through 50 but obviously she can do that because she's already past 50 on here but i'm still gonna let her do it Okay, good. Omari wrote Omari wrote on his letters for her. <laughs> it's right there and I wrote these letters. So, yeah. Korea did these. Mm -hmm. I did these. And Mama yes. did these. these. Okay, basically, and these. Anna is pizza. Anna is, uh, you still have to write those letters. So now um, Amari did them for you. So just write them down there. That's a pen. Don't use the pen. Use the pencil so you can erase it. But anyways, um, and basically she did a few assignments like matching these number words to the number and then counting these to put the number beside them. That's what she's done so far. And then uh, we're going to go back over some language arts stuff because we still have a lot to cover, which is, you know, that's school. I'm learning a lot. I'm already, seriously. <laughs> I have to go over these. It's okay. These but yeah, uh, we pretty much made it past these right here, filling in the blanks or whatever. Can you please stop, Amaria? Thank you. But we just did this little stuff, and then we're going to do some more stuff today, like decoding and um, learning about the parts of speech. I did a C. And stuff, like singular plural, stuff like that. Guys, I'm doing a C and B Good job, Anna. I know you could do it. But I'm guessing once we make it past these little problems, we're going to get more into... Like, she knows how to add and uh -huh. change in her head. Yeah, but they're supposed to look like it's that. It's definitely going to be totally different than one on paper. But I'm looking forward to it. Single digits, of course. So, yeah. But we, we're probably not going to get to that today. But we might go over it tomorrow. Mama. Yes, ma'am. But I want her to finish doing Mama. this. Yes, your handwriting look. is much better. Look, right here. I, yes, I see. Mama. You did amazing. Just it's okay, Anna. Just write the D again. But, uh, yeah, I really like this book. Um, I'm focusing on these books right now. Even though they do still have their online program, I feel like the pen and paper is like, really, really great because they can't type for the, you know, their whole life. They have to actually know how to do, how to, you know, penmanship is very important. Um, so, yes. So, eventually, Mama, she'll be... I don't know how to do a lowercase e, but because Kareem help me. It's okay. I'm going to help you, too. Uh, oh. But, anyway, y'all, it's just a little update. I want to add this to the video so y'all can see what's going on because I don't really want to uh, like make this. home and content that much because everybody does things differently. Mm -hmm. And I feel like I was putting a lot of pressure on myself when... That's not the goal. <laughs> I'm not trying to make be. this harder than it has to be, be because they are still okay. very young right now, and we have many, many more years to go. I did uh, see uh, so, so yes. Thank but you. anyways, Mari help me. So you know you to help books. The books Mama, we are using Mama. right now. Mama, this Mama. is one of Where them. Is this? Right. <laughs> and oh, uh, this is the one. That Mama, I'm look how good my E look. Okay, I see you tomorrow. That's great. Uh, go ahead and practice it, Anna. But right now, we're working on our penmanship. Amari has gotten much better with writing her letters. Her Mama, numbers, I did it. Which is amazing. I did an L. An L? Okay, but we have to do a lowercase one. I know it's right here. Okay, look. The lowercase one goes like this. You have to do that like a curve. I did. Okay, well, we're going to still practice. And you need to do the E. 
So the E will be like this. Look. Well, mama, uh, Amari already did Okay, it. but her doing it and you doing it is totally different. Just because she can do it does not mean that you can do it. So you have to practice on your own. Okay? It's fine. I'm going to calm down. We have plenty of time to practice. Calm down. I did put the key. Okay, good job. And Amari was struggling with writing a number eight yesterday. But today, she's writing them perfectly, which is great. Practice makes progress. Anyways, guys, I love you. I, y'all gonna see that I went to the dentist earlier and my teeth feel. And um, we decided on, I'm thinking we, we are deciding on Invisalign, even though I've been wanting to get braces forever. But apparently, Invisalign will be better as far as I can't do it you can do it calm down <laughs> calm down you can do it you can do it you can do it let me see your hand oh Mari, that was gross I'm so sorry here okay you watching okay so Look, you have to look at the paper. Look at the paper so you can see. So, this is how the E starts right there. And then you I'm go so around like this. Amaria oh, had a hard time writing E's when she was younger too. But she know how to do it now, which is great. So, what they'll let you know. Mm -hmm. If we practice, you'll get better. Mm -hmm. Okay? So, do it. Try to do it. <laughs> I think you're doing great. Stop whining. <laughs> okay, so what we can do, I feel like if she having trouble writing them on paper by herself like this, that we can do more tracing. So I do have, hold on, move it. I do have, oh, um, I do have dry erase markers. Look at me. Y'all want to know something so funny. Before I even had kids, I had a, a vision. God gave me a vision that I would be teaching <laughs> people on YouTube. Never thought that it would be true. I just thought it was a little dream, a little vision, a little bit. Anyway, so basically, I have a few books. I need to actually get more as they are advancing in their knowledge and grade levels. But since she's having trouble writing her E, I have this dry erase one and I have lots of dry erase uh, markers. So what we can do is practice with the dry erase writing Look. E's, uppercase and lowercase. Because that's pretty much what we are doing. So that's what we're gonna do right now. Um, Yes, and basically what Anna has been doing for the past two days to learn to recognize her letters. I was pretty much going for this book to see what I or she would be doing for the next few days. So basically what she has been doing is like this right here. These are the letters that she wrote by herself and then she traced these letters. So she recognizes all her letters all the way to J. And she knows some of the letters that are further than that, but we're still going over it. Okay, so this is something. I did a D. Good job, keep practicing. Okay, I did so, a D. Uh, oh no, be careful. <laughs> Let me show y'all something that we have done. Okay. So, second thing is this elf. I did a bee. And then we wanted her to color the frog red. And then basically to color each flower that had an elf on it. So she colored the flowers with the elf. And I helped her because she don't really like coloring. But she, she did really good coloring inside the line. So I'm proud of her for that. Because this is progress. Because <laughs> look. It, okay, I helped her do this one. Let me see if I can find one. Then she did it color. I did. I, I said I don't want to color the cat. <laughs> so this is a perfect example where she just scribbled on it and scribbled on it. But this, I told her, try to do it inside the line. And then, what? What? She just scribbled on what? But basically, this is how it tells you to find all the A's in the picture. So it's five, and then it tells you to go through the maze. 
And then, of course, I did this. And then she found what was B. And then she had to uh, find the B. And then do the mask. She liked one of these mazes. And she liked finding the letters in the picture. So basically, it's repetitive. As you can see, I did this. I like coloring anyways. And she didn't want to do it. And so she pretty much found the keys and put it in a little bag. I did it. Wait, who wrote this in the hand? I did. Oh, but I showed her the one that she did. I don't want to do it. I did. She this. said this. Okay, I, I did this. She did some of it, but I no, just I it. No, I said this. Mama said, "You want to do it?" And I said, "No." Being repetitive over the D's, and then she had to find it. It looked like a B, but it's a D. But yeah, same thing. Now I'm back to these and do it. Go and on another page. And she colored this one, I believe. And then I did these because she didn't want to do it. But I told her. If she don't finish the assignment, that means that she didn't pass. <laughs> but so she had to trace all the rest of the letters, and then uh, she had to find the alphabet, connect the dots. And, and then the she traced these. She did really good with that. And then she colored this, as you can tell. This is really, really dark, but she did good. She stayed inside the house, and then I just finished it for her. And then it's like, like this. why do you got something in your nose? And I did this, as you can see, she did this, but I just said, huh, I got a it really do when your hands are small, it hurts your hands. So I totally understand. But she didn't color this hip hop, but she did circle the H words. And so basically, I'll keep going and 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 going Efficient. Don't tell them where you got and it I from so they can see stay kit. And I also have other little things that we're going to work on. Um, like, um, I have. Mama, just already looks like a light bulb. But I really enjoy them because it's just different like with the, um, using your pen and paper. Oh, whatever. But, anyways, I love y'all. I'm going to see y'all later. Just wanted to add this into the vlog because we got a lot going on. Today, actually, we were supposed to go and get the Christmas decorations, but Cordell said we got to go Sunday. So, we're going to go Sunday because today is Monday. So, I'll probably just add that into a different vlog. So, we got to put our Christmas tree up yet. Can we at least go to the room where we need when it's the other tomorrow or not, well, after this tomorrow. Mm -hmm. I'm talking okay. about the other tomorrow after the, after the tomorrow when we wake up. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. We'll talk about that. But anyway, y'all, all right, peace. This little part was not supposed to be this long. Let me finish helping them so we can move on to the next thing because it's going to be time to eat dinner soon. Yeah. You know, it's like on a hair down today. Oh, my goodness. It's probably like. Uh, I don't even know what time it is. You can like five or six o'clock. Mm -hmm. But anyways, alright y'all, we're gonna see y'all later. But as y'all can see, this is my hair. I did some little mini bars and honestly, I'm probably gonna take a damn tomorrow. I don't really like this. Or I'm gonna wear a hat on my head for the rest of the week. Because I just don't like them. I don't know. I need it and it's like I don't want the braids in a braid, these mini braids. I would rather have twists because they don't look mini to me. Anyway, y'all, I'm about to make me some spaghetti or whatever. I got that on there real quick. I'm about to boil the noodles. Actually, I probably need to turn this up a little bit more. I'm gonna season the meat while it's in there. I ain't even eat that, but I'm gonna do it today. Look at the girls up here playing with the water by my laptop. Anyways, y'all, so they finished with their schoolwork. They did really, really great. It's 8 18. I'm about to take a bath. They already ate. They had pizza. I'm about to make some spaghetti. They don't want that, but I do. So, yeah. Anyways, this is my new favorite song right now, y'all. Because I just discovered this new YouTube channel. It's probably been about a month. And I love it. Listen. Yeah. 
Yeah. Anyways, I'm about to watch this sermon. I think he posted this. Let me see when he posted this. Wait. Oh, look, we washing the dishes. Girl, okay. Y'all by my laptop, too. They playing yes, up, over here in the dishwater. Hold on, right quick. Let me see what he posted. This. He posted this yesterday. I haven't watched it yet. It already got 37K views. But I love him. He is so real. He bought and I love it. Um, I mean, I watch. I think his name is Steven Furnick. Um, T.D. Jakes. I uh, like Tommy Gaskins. Like he's not really a pastor, but he be being real. Um, let me see. I will say Jerry Flowers. I watch with quite a few people, but like I, I be, I be need my Jesus juice, y'all. And I'm about to start watching Miss Jackie Hill Perry, cause I seen a clip of her and oh, it's Stephen Furtick. Oh, uh, let me see. And it's another uh lady, and it's a man, R.C. Blakes. I haven't watched him in a minute, but I do like him. Um. But I think it's Elevation Church, Transformation Church. Uh, I'm trying to find this other lady. I can't find it. I like washing the dishes. But anyways, um, oh, I want to say her name is. Oh, I can't think of it. But I can't even think of it. Let me see if it's in my search. Give me that blue dish. Priscilla Shire. I like her. Okay. Well, um, oh my gosh, I'm, I'm glad you didn't say oh my god. And then I like the shoe make oh, way. I like him. But you know what, y'all? I'm about to finish washing these food. Oh, y'all, I did not ask y'all to wash the dishes. But when the time comes, trust and believe, I will ask y'all to. Oh, Go get y'all clothes. I say I can talk about okay. Anyways, I'm about to listen to this sermon. I'm about to cook this food. And I'll let y'all see when it's done. Mama, are um, you picking out the clothes? No, go pick your own clothes out, please. Today, you please. Okay, calm down. Anyways, all right, peace. I mean, yeah, I've been picking up the camera like randomly, so I guess I'm put all these cooks together. My hair look I had a mess, even though I only did it probably like two, three days ago. But it's fine, because I just want my hair out of my way. But I don't think I'm going to keep this up, because I don't really like it. Anyways, I'm about to season this food, and I'm about to watch this sermon. And yeah, so see y'all later. If y'all watch anybody like um pastors or whatever let me know I, my sister just told me they put mario on netflix so i'm probably gonna watch that tonight um and i think i want to watch one more thing because today is technically my last night off that i don't have to get up early but i am gonna get up early in the morning go to the grocery store or whatever but yeah i love y'all i got the girls christmas list today they said is it santa supposed to do that why are you asking us i was like yeah, you're right. Anyways, <laughs> but yeah, it's a little late. I mean, I keep asking them because I keep changing their mind, which is hilarious. But anyways, I'm going to talk to y'all later. Peace. I'm going to call you back. I just noticed we're about to be good. What we are witnessing. Period. Anyways, I already seized my chicken. Ground chicken. And my water is boiling. I'm about to put the movies in there. Y'all have seen me put spaghetti a million times. This is the... I just got a regular one, but I'm going to season it up. And then, and then that. They had to stuff crisp pizza. It was two pizza boxes. I didn't see took the oven outside, but it was pepperoni and one cheese. So, yeah. Yeah, let me show y'all how rich my child is. Well, I don't know where my other bag of wallet is. But, hold on. I'm trying to open it. I gave her this little cute wallet I got from Walmart for years ago. These bags are so thick. Hold on. I'm trying to show them how rich you are. And it's hard to open the wallet. All right. Man, look at this. She got the things. Girl, this wallet was hard to open. Do it this way. Maybe it'll be easier. Open. Okay. Mama, you got you some, uh... Oh, I'm supposed to be taking my baby hair down today. Yes, I gotta take it down tomorrow. It's no, already late. Yes. Y'all got y'all clothes out for bath? Yes. So, yeah. And you ran the water? Good job. Uh. <laughs> I did. I started. I did this. She said. <laughs> it's cool. But anyway, I'm, I'm listening to this, so. Peace. The Bible tells us that.
Okay, he going off. But you know, as I know how to put it in to that thing, now that is a tweet. So, treat. I put place it up on here. I'm going to put it on there. So, you know what I'm ready? I'm going to wash the dishes. It's my food. It's late. We want to praise God in the seat. We want to praise God comfortable. We want to praise God with our arms folded. We want to praise Him with an attitude. I'm folded. Perfect thumb. He's snapping. He's snapping. Okay, so basically, I put some cheese on here and some hot sauce. Oops, yeah, I'm trying to get this to pop back up. Okay, he's snapping. I'm about to finish watching this. But anyway, uh, yeah. But it's now, they didn't even take me an hour to cook. It's 8.59. I put some more cheese. I put some Parmesan cheese on here. And I put like a like Mexican style spread of cheese. Warm it up in the microwave. Put some hot sauce on there. I don't know. This is just my thing. It looks fire. I give me some water. I'm going to sit here and watch this. Chill out. The girls. I already took a bath earlier. The girls still in the tub having a little fun. But yeah. Peace. I'll see y'all later. I don't know. The next clip might be next Sunday when I get the Christmas lights. Let me flip the camera. But anyways, my body's showing. But anyways, um, yeah. So honestly, I might end this vlog now. I need to get my eyebrows done. So I'm probably gonna get my eyebrows done tomorrow because uh, I gotta get up early in the morning. Anyway, so I'm on some errands. They open at ten, so maybe I can go there before Cordell gotta go handle his business. Um, so cause they looking kind of a little bit rough i don't know what i'm gonna do to my hair for the rest of the week this don't look that bad but i just it's not what i thought it was gonna be but anyways yeah i'm about to eat this food and i think actually i'm gonna end this vlog i might end this vlog with like y'all seeing my eyebrows done and let y'all see whatever i get from the grocery store tomorrow maybe a mini grocery haul i don't know that'll be the end and then the next vlog after it will be when we finally get the Christmas decorations, which will be in a few days, which is next Sunday. I don't think I'm doing Vlogmas because I just, I don't, I don't think I am. But I will just post my regular content. So, yeah. I know I sound down, but I'm really ready to get back to this. Because <laughs> this sermon is so good. Like, he being real, real. So, if you haven't watched this one, it's called Surprise by Strength. Uh, Pastor Keon Henderson. Keon Henderson TV on YouTube. This is Shani O'Neal, but now Shani Henderson, husband. He fire. He real. I love it. I'm glad I found him. But anyways, yeah. So I will see y'all later. The girls in the tub arguing. That's what they do. I guess they playing. Y'all probably can hear them because they real loud. But anyways, I love y'all, and I will see y'all later. Peace. Um, hope y'all enjoying the content that y'all do see for Vlogmas because I see a lot of people doing it, which is really, really cool. I love it for y'all. But honestly, mentally, I'm just not there yet. Maybe next year. We shall see. Um, but yeah, I love y'all. Um, also, kudos to all the people that are able to help the people in need for Christmas. I love that for y'all. Um, that's really a great thing. I definitely aspire to be able to do that. I'm gonna call my name. Um, but I do think I am going to probably participate in the coat drive at work. Um, because the girls have some old coats that they need to get rid of, so that would be cool. As far as that, that's probably all we will be doing this year. Would love to look more. I would love to do more. I need to look more into that. Maybe next year. But anyways, I love y'all. I'm about to eat my food while it's hot because I never really get to do that. It's so first favorite thing. But anyways, I love y'all. I'm going to see y'all like peace, 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 peace. Leave a comment. Let me know if y'all doing Vlogmas. Let me know how y'all December going. How did y'all wrap up November? Y'all ready for next year? What's up? What's popping? I'm looking forward to next year. I mean, I really accomplished a lot this year. This year was great. It went out very fast. But I'm definitely looking forward to next year. Always, always, always grateful to be in this year. But I'm going to see y'all later. Peace. I'm about to eat my food. I'm finished watching this. So, it's 9 o'clock now. 9.03. I kind of want to go to bed early tonight because I'm a little bit tired. I've been ugh, exhausted. But I'm going to be fine. I'm going to drink this water. Take my vitamins. I'll be all right. See y'all later. Peace. We just left Walmart this side basket.
of stuff. I'm not giving y'all a grocery haul because I'm ready to relax. We just left Walmart, so mm -hmm. I'm about to hurry up and put all this stuff in my freaking truck. I had to crank my car up to pull it up because whoever this is, who are all the way on my butt. And I'm trying to squeeze. Put his side on, hit that basket. But yeah, we got a lot of goodies. Hopefully y'all will see it. <laughs> I gotta give my sister this stuff back. So hopefully I can fit all this stuff in my trunk. Yeah, I know my car is dirty. We've established that for the longest time now. I've said it in several videos, yet my man still hasn't cleaned my car. Y'all got Candy something to say? What you got? Apple juice, what you got um, on a? Apple juice. Cordero put that car system in backwards. Usually on over there and Mario over there. But anyway, I'm about to hurry up before it get dark. All right, bye. Okay, guys, yeah, so it's like, I literally just looked at the time. It's like six something. We just got back to the house. Put all the groceries and stuff up. Um, definitely was very naked, but obviously it's full now. Um, I mean, just little stuff, whatever. Not that y'all probably care, but I just packed my lunch. The girls over there eating a lunchable, like a little pizza, lunchable, whatever. Um, I'm making my lunch, so I made some spaghetti, which is left over from last night. When we get back from my mom's house, they probably gonna eat spaghetti if they want that. But if they don't, then. And I made a sandwich also for tomorrow. I made me a sandwich for right now. Um, I put an orange in here. Some pudding that's been in there for a while, but I haven't eaten it yet. Um, I got some pineapples and mineral oranges. A peach yogurt. Water. And some hot chips. So this is what I'm gonna have for lunch tomorrow. I'm probably not gonna eat all of it, but I like to pack more instead of having not having enough. So yes. Okay, good job. You need to go wash. It's fine. Did you eat the gummies? You did. You didn't even ask me. I'm not talking about the other gummies. I'm talking you didn't eat the candy. I'm talking about the worm. You ate it. Okay, go wash your hands. You can touch the doorknob. I just wipe it out. But anyways, I'm um, yes. I'll let us taste it later. We got this from Walmart. Um, which we haven't had this before, but I think this is cool. It might be my new favorite candy. But anyways, we got it in mine. The Skittles sour are the best kind, but now they have me gummy, so I feel like this gonna be even better. But anyways, I'm really just recording this because I'm about to end this vlog finally. It's Tuesday night or whatever. Uh yeah, I'd be so scared to put that trash in there because I don't be wanting to make a mess on the uh, little thing. I'd rather them leave it on the table. I think I told y'all that before in a previous vlog. It's but anyways, cereal. it's cereal. I'm about to end this vlog. I love y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'll see y'all in the next video. The next video will probably be us going to get the decorations for the tree as we don't have them. Uh, I cleaned the house today. They recorded it, but... It smells like some um, clothes folded, bathroom clean. It's no dishes in the sink except these silverware. But yeah, house is clean. Everything good, 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 good. Anyways, love you guys. I will see y'all in the next video. I guess I am going to wear this hairstyle for a week because I guess it kind of grew on me or it's just convenient either way. Yeah, but I love y'all. I'm about to put my lunch up. I'm about to eat the sandwich, drink some water, and I'm about to go get my sister and Ty. Actually, I might let y'all see Thailand. I don't know my nephew and then we end the vlog after that once i, I guess my mama has some time but i just want to let y'all know that yes amari you want to say something if you was tyler tt you yeah. wouldn't have the time of your life yeah. if you were to see his tiny old hands mm -hmm. and his tiny old face mm -hmm. he's so cute he's so, so, so cute mm -hmm. So cute. And I can't believe we always not seen it here. And he don't even come over here so we can babysit him anymore. Because <laughs> he got older. But anyways, we're going to see y'all later. I love y'all. Peace. <laughs> um, I was going to end the vlog, but I forgot I'm about to go to my nephew and my sister. So yeah. I'll let y'all see his little face. And then it's going to be the end of this super long vlog. But hopefully y'all enjoy the long vlogs. Because I be liking watching long vlogs when it be some to see. But anyways, all right. Peace, peace, peace. That's so cute. Oh, yes, guys. 
Okay, guys, I forgot to tell y'all that I finally found these. I guess I wasn't looking for them, but they all over Walmart. But anyway, this is the Rubicon, and I'm not going to drink the whole thing right now, so I'm not going to try it right now. But in a later vlog, when I do try it, I will let y'all know what I think about it. But if it's, well, honestly, it's not even an if. Obviously, it's very good for you, you know, if you want soda. So it'll probably be something that I convert to, which is good. I'm glad people are making better options. But anyways, I'm not going to try right now because I'm not going to drink the whole thing. But actually, I could, but I'm not because I don't know. I just don't have to take it. Maybe I could. But anyways, I just want to show y'all it. And also, I will also let y'all know what I think of these too. Y'all know in my older videos, I used to love reviewing like stuff that was new. I still like to do that. I just do it to myself. But I start back going, um, this is from that Lunchable. It's like a Kool-Aid single in here. It's okay, Anna. Thank you. But all right, y'all. I'm about to eat my sandwich and then I'm going to go to my mom's house. Please. Okay, y'all. So, back again. We still haven't left yet. We decided to try these or more so I was forced into it <laughs> but they're okay the sour skittles definitely still are better I think the strawberry and the green apple is the best flavor they're not really sour at all though. which I don't know if that's a good thing because the sour skittles they be so sour that they make your mouth hurt as if you eat the whole bag, if you know you know. But yeah, they're okay. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't buy these again though. Mm -hmm. But anyways, peace. Yeah, I tried. <laughs> Tyler. Tyler! You trying to do your homework? Tata, what are you trying to do? Go. Yes, we're trying he said bling bling. Boy, give me my brace. Leave it alone. Leave it alone, y'all. One alone. sock he missing. <laughs> he came to the fair. Talent. He is not. Smacking your brace. I did that earlier. He turned around. He turned well, he didn't turn around. He was laughing, yes. He running from us. Where are you trying to go? <laughs> Where are you trying to go? <laughs> That's how Pup be out of That's how Pup he was saying. We didn't see him. Tyler. He tried to get him a lollipop. No, you can't give him a taste. He gonna take it, try to bite it. He don't want to taste. He want the whole tea. <laughs> he like. You were trying to give it to me when I was I sleeping. I really want it. I really want it for real. Anna, he said sure. Sharing is caring, cause oh. Yeah. All right, now let me have it. No. Let me have it. <laughs> <laughs> what the freak? Okay, so what's up, y'all? All right, so I know I said I was going to eat this vlog a long, long time ago, but this is for real the end of the vlog. I just ate a sandwich, and I'm about to eat some chips, and I'm about to watch my show. This is the last episode of Black Cake, but I'm really updating y'all because I'm trying this. It's the root beer, root beer flavor, and it tastes like root beer. It's not as acidic as a regular soda, but it tastes like root beer, and it is some acid. And it's pretty good. I will get it again since it's a healthier option than regular soda. So, I'm for it. It's, um, I'm pretty sure y'all have seen it all over the internet. Probably not this flavor, but this brand. So, yeah. That's what's up. I would definitely buy that again, but I'm about to watch finish watching this last episode of this then when i leave when i'm done with it i'm gonna go get my eyebrows done or whatever and prepare for tomorrow 
so i love you guys i will see y'all in my next video i hope y'all enjoyed this vlog you know it's kind of all over the place hope y'all enjoyed seeing my nephew seeing the girls and honestly i can't remember all the things that we did in this vlog but it was a lot i hope y'all enjoy it and y'all see i put my hair in these little tulip buns or whatever and it's kind of crazy or whatever but it's cool i ain't tripping um i love y'all i'll see y'all later peace and love tell me some type of traditions and stuff that you do with your family with your kids for the holidays which look forward to are you looking forward to the new year tell me some good anyways i'll see y'all later peace what's up y'all okay so this should be a clip that i add at the end of this vlog that i have been contemplating how i wanted to end the vlog because a few things haven't gone as planned but that's okay guys timing is perfection as you can see i am on my last page of tyler perry's book higher is waiting and when i tell you he is an on-time guy i am going to read this last little paragraph from this page and i hope and i pray that this inspires someone because it literally just lifted my <laughs> heart out of my chest so, Okay. When did we get this high? I don't know, she said, beaming. I was in decline. Her response brought me to reference and to thinking about life. Memories rushed at me full force like an ocean wave. I thought about how difficult it had been for me, chasing down my dream, how hard it was sometimes to believe in where I was going. I thought about the struggle, the pain, the hope, and the moments when I was plagued by doubt. I remember the times I was working dead-end jobs, moving through my days with my head down, just taking one step at a time. Some small ones, some big ones, wanting to give up, wanting to stop and sit for a while, wanting to wallow in my sorrow, nobody believing in me, nobody thinking it would come to pass and not realizing that every step was taking me closer to this higher place. My hike to the Hawaiian mountain peak was painful. Through it all, I was climbing higher, and yet at the same time, I had no idea how, how high I was. That's what it's like to chase down a dream. Sometimes in life, dreams are hard to follow. Just like that climb, you're not aware of how high you're going or if you're even moving, but every step, even when you can't see what's behind you or what's in front of you, brings you closer to your goal. It's in the climb. You might be struggling right now, but you're in the climb. People may not believe in you, but it's a part of the climb. They may take shots at you, but stay in the climb. You may need to stand alone, but you're in the climb. Even if you're not where you want to be right now, I want to say to you what my friend said to me. This is the best part. Now turn around. Look at how far you've come. God has brought you here. You won't be abandoned. Stay in the climb. So now it says, consider this scripture, Proverbs 13 and 12. Hope deferred makes the heart sick, but desire fulfilled is a tree of life. What can you tell yourself to help you stay in the climb? Look back and see how far you've come. I don't know who needed that, but I needed that. And I feel like that was just a perfect way to end this book. And just where I have been mentally lately. And just coming to the end of this year. And accomplishing all these goals. And some goals that just still have not been marked off the list but baby we're going into 2024 and we are happy we are uplifting ourselves we are staying positive we are staying in the climb because it doesn't matter what's behind us or what's in front of us god is carrying us and we're gonna continue 
to climb higher and higher. Hope that does something for you guys. I love you guys. I hope y'all enjoy this vlog. I am actually about to go ahead and edit it because I've been putting it off because I just wasn't here yet, if that makes sense. But I love you guys and I will see you in the next video. Peace and love. What's up, y'all? What's up, y'all? It's your see, and I'm back with a brand new video. Not really, but what's up, y'all? It's your girl, see, and I'm gonna add this to the end of my mother freaking vlog. So, since y'all really didn't even get to spend this last week with me, I told y'all I was gonna go get my eyebrows done. This is like forever later, so I just got off. I'm about to go get my eyebrows done. It's a little chilly outside. I'm gonna let my car warm up for a little bit. This is what my hair look like. It is like old. I think I had my hair like this for maybe a week or two. I think it's going on the second week or whatever, but you can kind of see the little curls, the little baby curls or whatever. Like kind of, I just kind of put it up or whatever. And then you can see my little baby curls or whatever but it's getting frizzy um i have not washed my hair but i did spray my hair with water and i put like a uh i put like a, some moisturizing creams in my hair or whatever so it won't be uh like dirty dry well not dirty but like dry and then i just lay my edges even though they look real real crazy but we're gonna act like they don't anyways it's these eyebrows i've been wanting to get them done for a little minute but I haven't because I just have not been wanting to interact with people, guys. So I just kind of been putting it off. But like, I'm just like, okay, let me just go do it. I have a little extra time. Let me go do it. Do y'all have days, maybe even weeks or a week that you just don't want to communicate with anybody outside of your home or you just don't want to communicate at all? You don't want to step outside and when i think of it it sounds like depression but at the same time it kind of sounds like isolation because i don't really label myself anything but i like people i can be friendly but at the same time i cannot like people too so there's that but anyways i'm not trying to make this little part long because i'm just gonna add this to the end of the vlog y'all see my eyebrows i'm gonna let y'all see them when they're done and then that's gonna be the end of the vlog obviously this vlog isn't edited yet because i literally just have not done it it's not like i haven't had the time i just haven't put my energy towards it and it's not that i don't want to it's just that i haven't i've just been trying to consume my energy because the year is coming to an end and i just really been trying to appreciate me show gratitude to god and myself for who i am who i'm becoming and living the moment and just cherish every breath if that makes sense and slow down so yeah but anyways i'm gonna see y'all i'm going to see y'all later but i mean i do feel like i added a lot of clips of a lot of things that i did recently in this vlog so hopefully y'all enjoy it let me know in the comments but if you decide to watch it just do that too um you can at least give it a thumbs up but yeah i definitely will have a lot of great content coming up especially in 2024 i'm really looking forward to it oh my gosh sounds like a huge number but yeah i'm gonna see y'all later peace i'm gonna call you back peace Ooh. okay y'all okay y'all so them okay okay y'all it's getting like dark or whatever but you can see them them just is red and like usually when i first get them done this one be on point and this one take a, a, a day or two but if you can tell they look better this is not on fleet this is not gonna take a minute but anyways yeah i got them done finally she was like merry christmas what because i'm probably not gonna see you till after the new year because take your eyebrows for a while to grow back which it do and i be trying to let them grow back because when they still be kind of thin i don't want them to be like pencil thin because i don't do anything to my eyebrows i just wear them how they are but anyways oh the stuff that she the little alcohol i love your stuff it smells so good but anyway y'all i'm see y'all later hopefully i can edit this vlog sometime this weekend anyways Oh, FYI, I still haven't put up our Christmas tree. Still haven't went even shopping for Christmas decorations or anything. I feel kind of 
Dad, Denny, and I kind of shouldn't because we've never put up a Christmas tree for decorations in our house. So, yeah. I mean, we would stay with his parents, but not at our place. I feel bad, but then again, I kind of don't because, like, this is my first time doing this and I'm, like, so not prepared for it. But, anyways, I'm about to go. Love y'all. See y'all later. Peace. I don't know what's for dinner, but I guess I'll figure it out. Hashtag real life mom ish. Peace. Okay, y'all. So, I decided to refilm my in the car ending of this video because um uh, i don't know maybe i'm tripping but you can't really see you can tell like a vibe of you can tell but you can't really see i mean i don't know i don't know what i'm doing i'm just ass because it looked like it was like super dark. Besides, you know what I'm saying? Like, did you flick, flick, flick? Did you? Yeah. But did you flick, 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 flick? <laughs> Anyways, I. Damn. You can kind of better see. But you not, not really like yeah my hair black you don't really do it no justice uh, but when it's like that blonde that one time i did that you could see it better but anyways i don't know i actually slick one color my hair but anyways bye i just want you to see it better because the lights that you can see better but maybe you can't i don't know maybe i'm tripping i don't know anyways all right all right all right, all right. <laughs> Three, four. Okay, so we three, doing this. Two. Uh, next, three, I'm just gonna show y'all probably me folding up the clothes. But to be honest with you, I don't even know if I'm gonna do that today. But I should because it's a whole bunch of it. But anyways, I love y'all and I'll see y'all later. Peace. Love you too. Love you, Papa. <laughs> silly, <laughs> silly, silly girl. Oh. Well, never mind. <laughs> Ooh, that kiss me, y'all. Welcome, y'all. It's your girl T, and I'm back with a brand new video. So, today, I am just actually, I was about to start a vlog, but I'm going to have to continue vlogging tomorrow because I just text my cousin, and we're going to have to reschedule. We were supposed to be going out to Dave and Buster's, which I'm super excited because I ain't been out in a minute. And I spent all last night doing my freaking hair. Had my my hands, my back, my booty, and my thighs, my feet hurt. For real. Because I wanted to go to work today. But my body was hurt today. I was like, oh, boy. When I went to sleep last night, I'm like, God dang. But it's because I was sitting in a wooden chair, which is crazy. But I don't, I don't know the correlation. But yeah, it had my body on fire. But you know what? I just want to record this just because my hair don't look good tomorrow. So. Yeah, this is what my hair look like. It's so cute. It's growing. I like these. These are my favorite parts. But yes, girl, got some hair done. But I tried my best to take my time. I ain't gonna lie. I'm lying. <laughs> I was rushing. It took me four hours, but I was trying to take my time and do the part that's what i mean so they can be like a little bit more uniform because usually i just be throwing some in there but this time i'm super fine it's very cute moisturized it's neat it's fire yeah girl hopefully y'all can see that but girl i just wanted to add this because yeah because i don't know i feel like i never really be capturing when my hair be like fresh be done or whatever so yeah but i tried my best with the parts they not perfect but they look good and like i do like i've been wanting to like start back making her content but yeah i gotta get these videos off my phone first because i gotta have some memory to do it because it be taking a long time especially like if you're in the shower or something it be it be taking a long time but yeah these like mini twists basically i just did a uniform and i braided this part and then i twist the rest of it down so yeah but i've been rocking these a lot lately because i like the way it looks it's cute 
Cause it's giving me the fantasy of having locks, but I don't have to commit. <laughs> yeah, that part. But anyways, I love y'all. I'ma see y'all later. Um, I just actually edited and posted my Christmas Eve vlog. Now I'm about to edit my Christmas Day vlog. And I'm probably going to post that either tomorrow or the day after that. And then it's a vlog before that that I need to edit. And then I still got like five other vlogs that I need to edit. And I'm still posting my period. I've just been so busy. And I'm like, girl, why I'm trying to write on them vlogs to edit and post. Baby, you can be vlogging right now. Because it's been memories that I've been wanting to capture. So, yeah. I'm not doing anything for New Year's. But for some reason, we all... So, I'm probably going to try to see if I can work on my other job. I don't really know. But I'm still getting paid or whatever. But I wanted to work on that day so I can get that cash, cash. If you know, you know. So, yeah. But then I'm letting us work. Because some people want to be off. So, but it's cool. I understand. Anyways, um, I think that's it. I'm about to put my bunny on. I'm about to go lay down because I am going to work tomorrow. I'm trying to see if I want to go work tonight or not. Because I really don't want to. But I feel like I'm going to be up anyways. So I kind of feel like I could. And I already got my lunch packed. Or whatever. I don't know. We're going to see. But I just want to try to see my hair. Because I thought it was cute. So I'm going to add this to another vlog. And I'm going to see y'all in a later day. Love y'all. Peace. Tell me what y'all think. Is my hair cute? I love these. Okay, yeah. So... My great phone cut off because my storage is full. So anyways, I'm about to end this and I'm going to see y'all later. And I'm just going to try to save the rest of my memory for the vlog that I'm telling y'all about when I go to Dave and Buster's. So see y'all later. Peace. And it's crazy. Y'all would think that I would have storage because I paid for like one TV. Barely got apps on my phone. I guess I, I do have a lot of pictures and videos. But anyways, this is my problem. I keep talking. So, I'll see y'all later. Peace.